What up dudes, it's Pixel Tricks. Welcome back to Subnautica. So I've been putting in so much work. I farmed so many materials, check this out. So first of all, our egg hatched, and look at this. We got a mini Derpo Dragon as a little pet. It's a bone shark, that's what they're actually called. How cool is this thing though? It's friendly to us too. And the cool thing about this is, if we take him out of the tank and we put him outside, he won't attack us, even though he's like an aggressive creature by nature. Since we raised him, he'll be our friend and he'll like, I don't know if he'll follow us, but um, yeah, I, I learned he'll he'll still attack the creatures around here. So he'll, he'll, he'll attack my cuttlefish, unfortunately. So uh, sadly, he's gonna be in here, but that's still cool. I also planted some of these uh, blood things. We can actually farm them in here too, which is pretty cool. But yeah, as you can also see, I also put all the quartz into this. And look how cool it looks from outside. Look at this, glass on glass, dude. Isn't that cool? Doesn't that look awesome? With a with, uh, uh, blood vine and everything too. I thought it looked really cool. Yeah, I like the glass windows and just be able to see through and all that. Welcome aboard, Captain. And thanks, and as you can also see, I uh, built this. It's an extra little room um, that we can walk to on the side. I actually had to like move it to the side like this. But yeah, it's pretty cool. That all grew too, so this is all fully grown. Let's go ahead and grab a potato right back. Okay, got some more of that. Let me make some benzene. It's funny, like, all those things just create this little thing. <laughs> Blood oil, weird. But yeah, let's go ahead and show this off really fast. Yeah, our little cuttlefish friend. He looks so cool at night, doesn't he? He's like, he kind of like glows. He's cool, he's a cool little dude. Play with fish. I forgot what I named him in my drunken, drunken state. But yeah, as you can see, this is all here. So now we'll have blood vine. Whenever we need it, it'll be right here. So we don't have to worry about uh, running out of that at all. I'm pretty sure this is just pointless, but it looks really cool. So that's a thing. So let's see. Also, I went out on an expedition because I had to farm materials, right? And on my trip, as you can see, I found more eggs. And I found two, I, I believe these are stalker eggs because I found them in the in the kelp forest. And I went specifically to the mushroom biome to try to find these. And these are the jellyfish eggs, I believe. And the cool thing is, if we have two of them, then they'll breed and they'll create other little friends too. So I think it's okay to have two of these guys. Because I don't mind that. Because they won't attack our, our friend, our cuttlefish friend. So we can actually just have a bunch of those things here. Which is really, really cool. So Oh yeah, I also uh, put a bunch of... Because since I added all the stuff, um, I, I had to reinforce this. So I used a bunch of my titanium. And I finally got another one of this for coral. So Carl has his own vehicle modification station, so we don't have to like go back and forth anymore. So let's go ahead and go into our alien containment. And I guess just drop these. Eh, 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 whoa. <laughs> Look at that. See, you're going to have friends. And they wanted to attack each other in there either, which is pretty cool. So other than that, I have uh, gathered all the materials that we need to create a lot of really cool things, actually. So let's see what we got. So I got one of these. I believe this is all it. Uh, one of this, advanced wiring kit, and this. So I think that's all we need to actually create the radio active, uh, whatever it's called. Nuclear reactor, yes. Okay, so now we can create this. And this is why I made this. Apparently it's gonna be a way better um, source of power here. Let's go ahead and rotate. Let's have it like right here. Alright, I hope this isn't a terrible idea. Exercise caution Don't. when handling radioactive materials. Carry fish. Exposure risks corrupting your PDA's recording of the circumstances <laughs> of your death. <laughs> wow, that's dark. That's really dark. Gary Fish, no one invited you to the party. Oh, this is so silly. 3400 power! Inactive. Oh, you know why? Because we need to create the uh, reactor rod? Oh, easy, dude. Glass, titanium, lead. Yeah, remember we got a bunch of those crystals from that one place. Something I actually found out about the, uh, I don't know how you say it, the green crystals. You can only harvest them when you have this on the radiation suit, which is kind of a bother, honestly. But, uh, 
Fortunately, I haven't even got the other. Go. I'm sorry. I know I just saw it. One titanium. Okay, one titanium. I got a bunch of glass and quartz because I needed all of it. I actually have to stop the scanner now. Because this drains power if you continuously have it going. It's really cool though. Um, let's see. One lead. So, rare. Lid. Yeah, and we have... Oh, we have four of these. Cool. Well, it looks like we are going to have to go on an expedition to get these. Not entirely sure it works. Do we have everything we need for it now? Yeah? Alright, let's go ahead and create a reactor rod. Um, not really sure what that... Electronic? Yeah. Alright. Whoa. Oh, God. <laughs> Sounds like a plain fallout again. Okay, maybe we shouldn't run super fast like a NATO. <laughs> you know? <laughs> like, run through my base with this highly volatile thing. All right. Okay, so we can equip up to four of these. Now our power is going to be juiced up. Oh, wow. And I, I believe we still maintain the power from the solar panels, too. So... If this ever runs out, which I'm pretty sure it does, then it should, like, we'll still be fine. Like, I, I'm pretty sure because of the solar panel, so that's pretty cool. So now I don't have to worry about running out of power entirely. So nice, dude. So we got that taken care of. We got nuclear power. There's a nuclear powered base now. Good God. All right. Other than that. We now also have something else that's very exciting. We have everything that we need. I believe, yeah, I put it all right here. All right, there's everything we need to make the Cyclops. So let's go ahead and head on over to our light pod over here. Oh, something else. Check it out, the voice logs. Remember the scary voices? Yeah, apparently these were the warpers. Yeah, communicating to each other because they're hunting us. Which is really crazy. Yeah, I don't know why they speak in English, but apparently that's them. Which is mighty interesting. So let's go ahead. Oh god, that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Climb. What? Let's build the Cyclops. Oh, I need Looper again. Damn it, me. Alright. <laughs> well, that was anticlimactic as hell, now, wasn't it? Alright. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and go in this. Girl, got the speed strats, dude. Just go ahead and grab this really bad. Oh, also, um, when I was out and about over there, getting the, uh, um, getting some materials. Yeah, no, finding the eggs, uh, for the cool blue looking dudes. I also put a beacon. The blood kelpstone, see? So now whenever we want to go back to the blood kelpstone, we have a beacon that goes straight to it. So it's really useful. So I do have a lubricant. I have one. Yeah, I have one left. Perfect. Nice. I actually thought I already found a stalker egg a long time ago, but I couldn't find it. So I, I went in the kelp forest because I love the stalkers. They look really cool. Okay, so let's go ahead. We'll go over to Thine over here. And build herself a Cyclops. Let's see this thing, dude. Okay, vehicle bay, vehicles. Cyclops. Whoa. Nice. Be advised, the Cyclops is designed to be operated by a three-person crew. Only experienced Helms people should attempt to pilot this vehicle solo. Uh, I think you're underestimating me. I'm too cool, though. I think I'll be fine. Woo. Uh, oh my god, I bodied something. God, I really hope that wasn't my cuttlefish. Board Cyclops. So I guess we get in through this. Well, we have a giant submarine. Captain, all systems online. Oh, thanks. Uh, man, close. Oh, okay. Oh, we have built-in storage. Oh, nice. Okay, that's cool. I like this already. Uh, apparently, it was designed. Oh, we even got. Oh, that was. <laughs> okay, let me just go. I gotta go work. <laughs> All right, you actually have an animation for this particular ladder. Interesting. What is this? Oh, we got a fire extinguisher. Okay. Oh. No vehicle. Oh yeah, we can put a vehicle in here. 
decoy launcher. De okay, so we can have a creature decoy thing. There's more fire extinguishers. This thing does run on power cells. Uh, oh, this is for the upgrades. Okay. Gotta get familiar with all of this stuff, dudes. I would like to go down the ladder. What the... <laughs> Huh. And this loops back. Oh, we can. Can I close it? Yes, please. Please close it. Thank you. I guess why not? <laughs> Actually, never mind. I might need to leave here fast someday. Who knows? What is this? Toggle internal lighting on and off. Oh. Oh, that makes it a little more. Whoa. Oh, we got sonar. <gasps> Oh my god. Uh, Zordon. Zordan. It's Zordan. Okay. So the base, uh, is gonna be black. Okay. We gotta get, we gotta get some of that green in there, alright? Alright. Where's my, where's my dark green? I'm having such a, got... Yeah, this is what I'm looking for. Yeah, okay, we'll just get black on black, alright? Hmm. Oh, okay. There we go. Done. Woo. Whoa. Okay. Floodlights. Ah. Okay. On. Whoa. I'm having fun. <laughs> I'm having fun with the lights. <laughs> All right. So can I open this? No vehicle docked. Can I go inside of it? I am floating. I am, I am Jesus. Mm -hmm. Praise thy name. Look at me, dudes. I can float on not water. Okay. So yeah. Oh, we need making another cyclops. Not a cyclops. Cyclops on cyclops action. No. Oh, this is so cool. All right. Uh, I want to make another sea moth so I can dock it in here. Yeah. What do we need? A lot of shit. All right. It's fine. We'll deal with that later. Let's go ahead and take this baby for a spin. What do you think, dudes? Turn this off. A little more immerse. Pilot sub. Engine offline. So we can power it. Oh, okay. So we can turn it off, right? What is this? Okay. So this is the camera on the keel. The coning tower. Oh, whoa. Can I do 360? Yeah. Can I move it? No, I can't. All right. Huh. Right, and this this screw. You can just turn that off. All right. I see. Okay, that's good to know. What about this? Silent running. Rig for silent running. Whoa, dude. I think that might take more power. Maybe. Okay, there's a health bar. Not sure what this is. Power? I'm guessing. Not sure. Uh, all right. Engine powering up. Oh, well, good. Okay, a little intimate. Oh. Oh, oh, why? Okay. Oh, I think. Is there something behind me? Might be some. Okay, okay. Listen, little fish friend. Oh, God. Oh, my God. It's like driving a truck. Christ. Okay, well, off to adventure, dudes. Oh, careful, dudes. Okay. Ow, oh, sorry, fish. Sorry, fish friend. Oh, God. I'm going to destroy this thing immediately. All right. Uh-huh. Oh, all right. Kind of want to get some torpedoes for this bitch. What do you think? Oh, wait. Pilot? Yeah, 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 yeah. Engine powering down. Okay, good. What do I do with it? <laughs> so, two titanium. Wow, I'm running low, actually, after all that nonsense. And go, I never thought I'd see the day when I finally ran out. <laughs> Let's go ahead. I got plenty of water. Found a bunch of salt. Yeah, we got tons. Let's just grab one. We got one of those. So now, we should be able to go over here. Go to this. Vortex Torpedo times three. They look mighty small. I don't think they're designed to go in there. Yeah, I think about it, huh? It definitely doesn't look like it. We'll 
first of all, if we're going to... Oh, wow, they, they take a lot of room. Okay. Just make sure that's at the ready. Okay. I would like to go in this place. Thank you. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Thanks. Okay. I'm stuck now. Alright. Girl. Off to adventure, dude. There's that light pod thing. I think it's in dangerous area, though. So let's see if we can get this Zordon. How neat. <laughs> A very cool. I'm nervous about driving this shit around, huh? So, uh. Oh! Oh, perfect. Perfect. Nice. Let me see here. You know what? It's hard to see. Let's try that off. There you go. Oh, that's bright. <laughs> um, okay. Decoy? Can I launch? No. You tell me you don't want this torpedo? Do you want this in the upgrades? You do not. Creature decoy. Three titanium and a wiring kit. Okay, so... Guess we don't need these right now. Deployments? Creature decoy. Attracts creatures to its location. Can be deployed by hand or by submarine. Cannot be reclaimed once deployed. Okay, so we got a creature decoy. Very cool. Oh, we got multiple. Oh, wow. I guess you get uh, three of them at a time. That's very useful. Well, let's go ahead and put... Oh, you know what? No, we could, we could put it away over here. Check it out. Because we have storage in this. It's gonna be a long ass video today. <laughs> well, I wanna go on an adventure though. I had to set all this stuff up. It took forever. Okay, I would like to go inside of you now, please. Zordion. Thank you. Dot. Nope. Do, do, do. Eh. Yeah, let's go ahead and put away two of these. Very cool. I should load this thing up with water. And now, how do we, oh, we go through over here, right, now we have a creature decoy, perfect, alright, so if some gnarly comes, then we'll be set, hopefully, okay, engine on, Powering up. let's go, babies, oh, we'll be fine, you're always worrying, aren't you, Zordon? Okay, we're going straight into Leviathan territory. Uh, okay. Well, shit. How do I descend? Do I press down? Can I reverse? I can reverse. I think flanked. Emergency speed. Body. Vessel tilting. Excessive noise. The head standard. Excessive noise? That's no good. I hit. I hit a. F I hit a fit. Oh. Okay. Oh. How do I? Zordon. I hit slow. Okay, so that's the speed. Oh, C. C to descend. Interesting. Okay. Let's not go too far. Oh, whoa. Ah. Okay. Just getting used to the controls here. Can I move, like, while I'm doing this? Yeah. Okay. So, that's gonna make things a little easier. Oh, God. Alright, so we're going to this territory. So I think... Engine powering down. So we'll turn off it here. And now, we can go explore with our prawn suit. Oh, this is going to make getting around with the prawn suit so much easier. Yeah, it's these guys that I was talking about. These blue dudes. Uh, you can find their eggs around this area. And it's pretty cool. Alright, well, let's check out this light pod situation. 
Isn't this... Re this is definitely... Oh, whoa, you look so cool. It's beautiful, dude. Go ahead and get a nice view, really fun. Oh, wow. Oh, my. Oh, there you go. You did it. <laughs> look how cool they look. Whoa. Yeah, they're friendly. You don't have to worry about those guys. Alright, well. Let's carry on. Got a grappling hook at the ready. I wonder if I can latch onto a reaper with this thing. Whoa. Oh my god, I can make myself get super speed. Look at this. Girl. Oh, it makes going around so easier. Oh, fuck, it's the zappy ones. Gotta watch out for those things. Okay. Well, fair enough. Go. Whoa. So we're going into this biome. It's pretty dangerous. There's a lot of meanies here, dudes. Oh my god, volcanic ash, dude. Whoa. Come on, grappling hook. Don't let me down. Need you. Whoa. What's that? Bone shark, please. I have one of you as a pet. Stop. Stop. He's trying to bite me, dudes. Oh, God. I don't want to fuck with those things. God, this is a, such a hyper-aggressive area. No. I'm getting zappoed. There's so much to mine here. Girl. Ah. Fucker. Fight each other, not me. I'm too cool, though. Oh, really? If you say so. I'm getting fucked. Go. What's this? Repulsing. Nice. First aid. Yeah. Not really a doctor. I know that's what it says in my ID, but I never have been. She did the medical exams. What does a doctor do these days? Uh, need to know about manual resetting bones. When was the last time a top surgeon actually cut someone open? That's what the robots are for. Doctors these days read diagnoses off the computer readouts. For that, I'm perfectly qualified. But what good is when I'm not connected to the main network? I'm bleeding. I've got glowing green pulsules grown from my hands. A run of self-scan tells me uh, I've got skin irritation. The only thing I've studied in medical school was how to lie convincingly. The hell do I know how to treat an alien disease? I think I'm gonna die down here. Oh my, dude. Wow, you're too lame, though. That guy is... Wow. Are we affected? Self-scan. Yeah, I, I've seen a lot of the fish are infected too, like because they're all green, right? I thought that was just the radiation, but maybe that's the disease. I literally just saw blue. Yeah, that guy right there. See? That's crazy. Let's get the hell out of this biome. <laughs> this place is not too friendly, though. Definitely one of the meanest ones I've been to. It's so cool looking, but man. I'm gonna play. I would like to leave now, please. Thank you. Go. Let's get back to our ship. We got another radio signal, too. But this is so cool, being able to bring the prawn suit. Got a little messed up with that. I think I still need to get used to it. God, I need water. Mm -hmm. So I guess we'll head back to the ship. Kind of sucks that I can't pick stuff up in the prawn suit. Gel ray egg discovered. Stalker egg discovered. Oh, we got friends waiting for us back home. How cool. Alright, well, sweetness. Sweet fish. What is this? Oh, yeah, see, this is where I found the egg. It's in this biome. I think it just spawned on that corner right there. Uh-huh. Alright, well, let's head back to Zordan. 
sword down. Mm hmm. Sure, this is not a mean biome. Wow. I'm sure there are meaner ones out there that, whoa. See, there's another egg. Uh, they're pretty common. It didn't take me too long to find the other one. I found those over by the, uh, the blood kelp zone, though. The entrance to the, the blood kelp zone. Yeah. See, there's another one. What's silly? Huh, the dead meme. Our names were all over the so silly. Well, I like this. I like this Cyclops. It's a little nerve-wracking. Oh, what is that? Hello? Huh? Scanner and fragment. Well, for you, titanium. Mm-hmm. Damn it. There's my Zordans. I hope I can fly all the way up there. I really do. <laughs> oh, wow. I've been recording for so long, dude. Yeah, that's just for the... Uh... The Cyclops, yeah? We already got everything we need. Hmm. Just having to look around right here. Please tell me you can make that. I'm gonna have to latch onto my Cyclops here. Okay, right. hey, <laughs> give me, give me edge. I hope this isn't damage. Oh God, you can do it. I believe, I believe in you. No, oh, yeah, yes, perfect. <laughs> That grappling hook is mega sick, dude. Okay, how's your health? Did I hurt you? You look fine. Alright. Alright, yeah, so we're gonna have to start refilling our, uh... Our things here. Our power cells. I need to remember that. Before we go on the expedition, we have to recharge. The, I, I should just make a whole bunch and put some backup ones in here while I'm at it. Huh? Maybe I'll do that off camera. Alright, so I gotta remember it's C to descend. We can go on our things here. Switch our camera view. Oh, this is so cool. Huh. Look at that. Look at that unrendered texture. Fuck. Alright, go. <laughs> I'm getting better at piloting it, at least. This game is so sick, dude. <laughs> it's so sick. What was that? Wow. Yeah, this is like the very bottom of it. All right, the screw. Oh, we gotta be careful. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa there, buddy. Goodness. It's behind us. I think that just means we're like really close. Yeah, this is kind of dangerous to have a Cyclops up here in the safe shallows, isn't it? <laughs> so we used to hit stuff on the bottom. I, man, I wanted to throw my decoy, but I don't want to waste it. Uh, we'll, we'll see it some other time when it's needed. I need to start mining my resources here. All right, dudes. Well, ooh, ooh, oh. Just stay all the way up. Yeah. It's for the best. Oh God, you can do it. Ah. Oh fuck no. <laughs> Come on. Um, uh, I think we're good. Go see a little bit. I'm gonna just park it right here. So let's turn this off. Good. Nice. Our first Cyclops expedition. Nice, dude. Oh, whoa. Uh, we gotta go. Dude, let's go. Ch no, I didn't want to go back. Damn you. Uh, uh, alright. Got 3,400 power. <laughs> Limitless power. Let's have a look. Whoa. Oh, look. It's the remains of the eggs They're, since they've all hatched. Whoa. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at the little baby stalker. <laughs> Whoa. You got bigger. Did it? Is it me or did this thing get like way bigger? Look at that. Oh, I didn't know they got bigger in the tank. That's really cool. Why are you a shadow? I got a shiny. I got lucky and I got a shiny bone shark. Not bone shark. Stalker, friend. Look at this. Our cool thing here is uh is all colorful and cool now, dudes. Nice. And full of life. Yeah, we got blood oil in there. They can munch on that all they like. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you have to like upkeep the tank or anything. 
But I dig it so much. These are some of my favorite little critters in Subnautica. Now we got friends of them. That's so cool. I love this game, dude. This shit's so neat. Well, I guess uh, we got to start thinking about upgrades for the Cyclops and all this shit. It's so grindy, though. Uh, I will admit, it is one hell of a grindy game, but hey, it's fun, though. Huh? It's, just, it's nice being able to show off everything as it comes together and be able to edit out all the super grindy bits in between. All right, dudes. Well, I hope you enjoy it. And uh, hopefully my house doesn't melt. Yeah, that would be unfortunate. And I guess I'll catch you guys later. Peace.